Yo, what's up, world? It's your man, Swim Jim Longfoot, a.k.a. the GOAT, King of America. Welcome to day 213. 213. Like, what? Long Beach? 213. Long Beach like that? Of diabetes and not a day of vlog that I do every day. Show y'all how I combat this diabetes with the one, two. You feel me? Today is the 2nd of October, 2020. It's Friday, Friday. You feel me? Yo, if you are new to the channel, make sure, of course, you subscribe below. Hit the notification bell so you can keep up on all things Slim Jim Longfoot, such as my product reviews, my how to videos for the small YouTubers, you know what I'm saying? Um, daily vlogs, of course, obviously, and my art video series, GOAT 1408 TV. Oh, live streams too. I do live streams here too, as well, people. Yo, shout outs to the regulars of my live chat crew, which of course is Latanya Porter, my sis, Every Gavala the Greek Goddess. Sexy Treats 1408, Queen Candace, and Lady Capricorn Terry. Those are the five members of the live chat crew. You feel me? Anyways, yo, all right, we got we got some things to talk about. Oh, first off, of course, to the regular GOAT Nation, to everybody who's already been here. Yo, what I need for y'all to do, for my members of the GOAT Nation, my citizens of the GOAT Nation, I need y'all to spread the word on the channel. We trying to get to a thousand subscribers Hopefully before Halloween, y'all. Why? Because I want to do so many things with the community tab. First and foremost, we're gonna get, we're gonna throw another free art party. We threw one when we hit 500 subscribers. We're gonna do another one when we hit a thousand subscribers. You feel me? So I was gonna, you know, I could do some contests for y'all, but ain't nobody been participating in them, so I don't know. You know what I mean? Anyway. Yeah. Anyway, but uh, I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I woke up this morning. I it's funny because when I was asleep, I ain't feel no. I ain't feel no uh, no no cold, no heat, no nothing. I ain't feel nothing when I when I was asleep. And then as I came back to myself and woke up. It was freezing cold. It is definitely fall, y'all. AKA winter or well, Georgia water changed like every freaking day. Like it'd be four seasons in a day, but it woke woke up this morning. It was super cold. I had to turn that dang on heat on, man. I was like, nope. Sorry. You know what I'm saying? Other than that, I was gonna be like, man, yo, y'all don't even understand. I was about to be sleeping on y'all for the rest of the day. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna take my break today, but you know what? I ain't I'm up now. So and, and you know what people know me when I'm up I'm up you know it's funny because yesterday was day 212 of um you know what I'm saying uh diabetes and I and um you know what I'm saying 212 is a is a cool number because 212 is um well 212 is not um let's see that was the very first issue that I got of the uh, Kenny Itch man back in December of 1986 my dad got me that issue issue number 212 of the uncanny X Men back in nine and back in eighty six, um, that um, was smack dab in the middle of the Morlock massacre. That was the um, uh, storyline going on at the time of that comic book. Back then, of course, you know, what I'm saying I was like, what is what is this weird comic book? You know, what I'm saying because I thought the X Men were weird back then because I didn't really know who they were back then. But of course, as y'all know, thirty some odd years later, you know, everybody know the X Men and you know like the X Men even though the movie sucks, but hopefully, you know, now that they're back within the realm of going to be doing the rest of their movies will be MCU related, you know, hopefully we'll get a chance to see the X-Men as we should have been seeing them all this time as opposed to the, you know, crap movies we've been getting for the past 20 years, in my opinion, but, you know, the right opinion, yeah. But, um, what I got this morning to eat, y'all, I got oatmeal with cinnamon raisins and as i was um putting this together got a visit from my man to the right grand hustler oh, 1017 brought me some waffle and bacon from waffle house are you about to do your dailies yeah I got it. hold well hold what you got because i ain't did mine either okay. so i, I roll with, with some dailies with you we talking about Dayless on Dragon Roger, y'all. If you ain't played the game yet, go ahead and play it. My invite code is in the description. 
vibe. I don't see it enough about my description links. Yeah, I got lots of links in the description, y'all. So check my links in the description for my books that I have on Amazon, for my comic books that I have, and also my invite code for Dragon Roger. You know what I'm saying? If you want to play that awesome game, it's on Android and, um, you know, um, I, I stuff. Anywho, once again, y'all, today, yesterday, of course, was October the 1st, aka my niece's birthday. And here are my numbers for yesterday, y'all. Let me tell y'all what my numbers were for yesterday. Before breakfast was 115, before lunch was 124, and before dinner was 121. Before uh, breakfast, of course, I had this yesterday also. Well, yesterday I had some, I had this with honey in it. Today I just got oatmeal with cinnamon and raisins. Um, and for my lunch and dinner, I had the same thing because I fixed, um, I still don't know what I want to call it, y'all, but if you look in the description yesterday, um, you know, it's wheat egg noodles, ground beef, Italian seasoning, um, lemon pepper, and cheddar cheese. Those are the ingredients in the concoction that I create. Kind of like a hamburger helper type thing, but you know, it's homemade. Um, those were the ingredients in the first one. The second one, I put Parmesan cheese, you know, for lunch, I mean, for dinner, I put Parmesan cheese in it um, when I had it for dinner. And I will have the remainder of it uh, for my lunch later on. But um, yeah, so that's what I had for um, lunch and dinner yesterday. You know, I still don't know what I want to call it. I still haven't came up with a name of it. As a matter of fact, I'm gonna show y'all a picture of it. I'm show y'all what it looked like uh, when I fixed it for lunch, so you can see what that thing looked like. It looked good to you. And, you know, I this is my first time fixing it since you know what I'm saying. Um, you know, everything happened. But you know, these noodles they they're egg they're, they were wheat egg noodles as opposed to the white egg noodles that you know people normally buy and so yeah there you go Ooh, look at that thing though. that thing was good that thing was good it was good job now today october the 2nd today is a today is a momentous day because today you know uh it's a it's an anniversary of both uh, life and death. The life part, of course, being that today, October second, is Grand Hustler's oldest child's birthday. Happy birthday, Gabriel! If you see this, if you see this, you better see this. Your daddy better tell you to see it. Happy birthday, Gabe! And make sure Gabe see it. You better see it, Gabe. I'm listening. Anyway, happy birthday, Gabe. Boy, tall too, y'all. My boy, tall. Nah, no, ain't no. He, 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 man. He, he, he tall. Yeah. Mm. And also, today is um, 31 years. 31 years since um, my big mama, my grandma died. As I told y'all yesterday. My niece was born yesterday on October the 1st. And the day after she was born, that was when my grandma died. So, as a lot of y'all know, you know what I'm saying? When one life comes into the world, another one, you know, leaves. And that's exactly how it was uh, that those two days, some odd years ago. Some odd years ago. So... What about y'all in the comments? Is your grandparents still living? And yeah, so, what memories do you treasure with your grandparents? Or treasuring with your grandparents? Mm. You ready not to change, y'all? Not to change. Mm. Y'all know I just forgot, right? I'm hungry, y'all. I'm supposed to be doing my... I ain't even did my number... 
I gotta stop what I'm doing, see? I ain't even said my grape. I'm hungry, y'all. I ain't did my numbers for this morning. I already got some oatmeal in me. I know somebody probably in the comments like, by this point, like, wait, did he do his numbers for this morning? Too bad this ain't live, somebody could stop me. Like, wait, did you do your number for this morning? Anyway, we about to do the numbers for the morning now. So it's like, not necessarily before breakfast, it's like in the midst of breakfast. So we about to do this thing right now, y'all. <laughs> your boy was getting hungry. I was looking at the oatmeal and shoot, I had completely and utterly forgot. Tell you, man. So, y'all bear with me. Cause your boy was hungry. And I died in. I ain't even seen my dad on grave. Y'all know. Y'all know your boy true. That. You see, I hate this crap. Now, I just pricked myself, and the daggone thing didn't register. And I know daggone well it's supposed to be registering just then, and it didn't even register. So I just wasted a test strip just now. Boy, that 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 be pissing me off. K. Anywho, let's do that one more again, shall we? It's always fun to prick yourself twice. Night. Nah. Anyway, just said the grace. 213 is already wilding, y'all. But numbers are good though. One eleven. One eleven is the number. One eleven is the number for this morning. And we're gonna work on getting that down because it's been a while now since I've been under uh the one uh hundreds well the last time i was up on the 100s you know what I'm saying um was uh wednesday two days ago and the last time that i had two numbers on the 100s was um uh, on monday with uh 82 and 95 for lunch and dinner so um as y'all know i pride myself with having all my numbers on the 100 out of these 213 days, 55 of them have been under 100. So that's where we at. You know what I'm saying? As of right now. So with that being said, y'all, we are about to get into the shout out, shout out, shout outs. A A A. Shout out, shout out, shout outs. A A A. We about to get to it, y'all. As y'all know, yesterday I was joined by my sister, Latanya Porter. Appreciate her for coming through. You know what I'm saying? And now we are about to get into, as I just mentioned, the shout outs. For yesterday's um, daily vlog. So for those who are new to the channel, new to this, uh, when I do my shout outs, I, of course, do my shout outs to those who come in it on yesterday's daily vlog in the regular comments you know what i'm saying laid back way back in the may back in the playback and of course those who um uh are in the live chat so we are about to get the shout outs out the way real quick and then we're gonna get into the craziness of this morning that was just found out the breaking news that uh, occurred you know this morning We'll get into that in a minute. I'm going to ask Grand Hustle if he know. I'm quite, quite sure he does, but if he don't, then I will tell him in a minute. Um, Kiana Vision. Kiana Vision in the building. <clears throat> Say happy birthday in the regular comments to my niece. Lady Capricorn Terror with her awesome new picture looking all sassy up in that way. Ah. She said catching the replay, SJL. Happy birthday to your niece. Lots of love and blessings sent her way. 
Latonya Porter, hey, sorry I missed you. Thanks for the shout out. And I, of course, say on to that. Oh, I said no problem, love. I have already responded to that one. And let's see, I think. Oh, Sexy Trees 1408 say happy birthday. Enjoy your day. And I say on to her, thanks, love. And London Literate. London Literate said, hey, Slim, happy birthday to your niece. Shout out to London Literate. Oh, also, as y'all know, this month, you know, being October, another thing too, uh, for artists out there, uh, for years now, we have been doing well. I ain't going to say we because I actually never participated in it because I don't really care. But a lot of artists in the world, of course, participate in this thing called Inktober where they spend 31 days in the month of October, all 31 days, obviously, um, drawing an ink picture for each day. You know, some of them have themes and things of this nature where, you know, they might follow somebody's theme and do something related to that theme each day. I never cared to participate in it because, you know, I mean, you know, that it, it's cool, but it's more so like for those who don't really draw a lot so to speak or you know just want to be a part of a fad and you know i don't i don't care for fads and you know um you know trends and crap like that you know even though you know that does you know get you seen but i just never care for it i've never been a trendy person i've never been a trendy person y'all i just i just don't care I'm sorry i don't but um with that being said, not only you have Inktober, but you have Vlogtober. And see, Vlogtober, which I just recently found out like last month about, Vlogtober is basically, you know, YouTubers out here, you know, trying to do a vlog every day of the month. And since, of course, I'm already doing vlogs every day, this is my 213th day straight doing a daily vlog. Vlogtober falls right in line with you know what I'm saying? What I'm doing this month because I'm doing a vlog every day this month anyway. So, you know, so I'm not participating in Vlogtober. I mean, I'm practically any. I mean, if that's the case, I've been doing it since Vlog Timber and Vlogus and Vlog Lie and Vlog Goon and Vlog Main or whatever you want to call the crap. I don't know. I don't know. But yeah. All right. In the regular live chat. Who we got in the regular live chat? In the regular live chat. Victoriously Shay was in the building yesterday and she shared the uh, broadcast. Shout out to Victorious Lachey, y'all. Victorious Lachey all day and be holding it down. Tina Bellina. Tina Bellina was in the live chat yesterday, y'all. She was letting me know, you know, doing the live chat that Lady Capricorn Terra, you know, wasn't gonna be there. Yeah, I appreciate her for coming. Mashana was in the live chat. Latanya Porter, Latanya Porter was semi in a live chat yesterday, but it wasn't really Latanya Porter. It was actually me on Latanya Porter's phone because we was out on the back at the time and I wanted to let y'all know that I was there, but it was me up on the Latanya Porter's name right there. Kiana Vision was in the live chat yesterday. Let's see, who else was up in the live chat yesterday? Uh... That is it, y'all. That's everybody who was in the live chat yesterday, y'all. Everybody who was in the live chat yesterday. Shout out to my sis once again for coming through, making it do what it do. Meantime, between times, we are about to get into the breaking news of this morning. You heard about the breaking news for this morning? Oh, he ain't heard about the breaking news of this morning, so I get to tell him. <laughs> is it about Trump? Yes, yeah, but uh, Mr. Fortified. By Trump? Mm-hmm. He got the wrong. He got the wrong. He got the wrong. It's, it's, it's the late, great Gil Scott Heron 
once said, you know what I'm saying? This could all be a coincidence, a, a little C coincidence, or it could be a big C conspiracy. I don't know, whichever way you want to call it. So convenient that, you know, he now gets to hold up in 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 the in the in house blanco when it's supposed to be you know you know election going on and campaigning and debates he gets to hold up in the white house for about a month or whatnot especially with his advanced you know senile age he gets to hold up and not be out there as he should be so hmm i don't know you know, I ain't into politics like that because it's all bad reality shows to me. You know, pun intended. Yes. It's just, yeah. Yeah. But at the end of the day, me, myself, I don't wish no ill will towards anybody unless they mean ill will towards me. Then we got a problem. But, you know what I'm saying? Like I say, I don't wish ill will towards anybody. It was so many people wishing that man dead in 2016, which is why so many people did die in 2016. You know what I'm saying? Like, for those that probably don't remember, 2016 was a crazy year full of crazy you know, you know, weird deaths, you know, and because so many people had so much bad energy towards him, where you got to remember one and one most important thing, where to direct your energy to, direct your energy towards positivity, you know what I'm saying, because negativity only wins, um, negativity only wins when that's all that you're thinking about. You know, it's all about the law of attraction, y'all. The law of attraction is going to dictate what happens with you throughout that day. If you start thinking about all the things that you don't want to happen, those things will happen because you're directing that energy towards them. It doesn't matter that you don't want them to happen. It's the fact that you're directing that energy towards them. Direct your energy towards the things that you want to happen. Direct your energy towards the things that you want to have go about great in your day. You know what I'm saying? I believe in the creator. You know what I'm saying? I believe in the son of God. You know what I'm saying? A.K.A. Jesus Christ. You feel me? But at the end of the day, it's all about believing in yourself as well. You feel me? Because with that being said, we're all... You know what I'm saying? Creations of God, which means we all have God within us, which means, you know, we're connected to the stars. We're connected to the earth. We're connected to the universe, period. You feel me? It's not just, oh, there's one person like, you know what I'm saying? The same way pastor, preacher, deacon can tell you what's going on in the Bible. Guess what? You can pick up the Bible yourself, read it and interpret it for yourself. You know what I'm saying? basic instructions before leaving earth you feel me that's what it's all about so eoto each one teach one you feel me you know what i'm saying we can go all day on that but i don't think y'all ready for them conversations anywho like that video like that playlist i'm going y'all one love